Hi, in this video, you will see how to use a free tool to find first-hand witnesses and their photos or videos on X when covering breaking news. Inbit We Verify is a plugin code developed by FP. It has many useful features for fact-checkers, journalists, and researchers for online investigations. Today, I'm going to show you how it works with searches on X on a computer. Let's say we're covering the devastating earthquake in Japan on New Year's Day 2024 while our reporters are still on their way to the area. How can we quickly find the first few videos posted by witnesses on X to verify and maybe use them in our reporting? First, add the Invid We Verify plugin to your Chrome browser. Once added, it will appear with other plugins on the top right corner of your screen. You can click on the little puzzle icon to find Invid and click here to pin it to your toolbar. Next, click on Invid's icon and then open toolbox. Click on search and then X search, which allows you to run advanced searches on X to the minute and it offers a variety of filters. For example, you can look for results by keyword or hashtag, account name, type of post, language, and location. To look for photos, type in images in filter. For videos, type in native underscore video. Putting media if you want to include photos, videos, and GIFs at the same time. In this case, what you need is the keyword for earthquake in Japanese, Jishin, then native underscore video for filtering only videos and the time range to ensure you find the first few videos posted right after the tremor. I recommend you select GMT for the time range of your search because the local time doesn't always work. The New Year's Day earthquake occurred at 10 past 4 p.m. local time in Japan, which is 10 past 7 a.m. if you convert it to GMT. There were way too many posts on X about this earthquake on that day, so you need to restrict your time frame down to a short window. Let's try 710 GMT to 715 GMT on January 1st, 2024, and see how many videos we can find just five minutes after the quick. Before clicking on submit, make sure you're logged into X because it will take you directly to results on X. Once you're on the results page, Click on Latest, then the results will appear in reverse chronological order, meaning the oldest one will appear at the bottom. Scroll down until you find the very first post that mentions earthquake in Japanese and features a video of the aftermath. The first video might not always be visually compelling like what we're seeing here, then you need to scroll up to find other videos which are useful for news coverage. For example, this video was posted by a Japanese user four minutes after the earthquake, with its caption claiming it was taken in front of the Oyama Shrine in Kanazawa, in the quick hit Ishikawa Prefecture. After running a reverse image search of the video, checking the user's profile pages on multiple platforms, and verifying the location of the video through Google Street View. It seems this video is new and this user is highly likely a witness. 
but you also need to reach out to the user for confirmation of copyright and permission to use this video. Remember to always verify the authenticity of user-generated content and obtain written permission from the author before you use it in your reports. I hope you find this tutorial useful. Don't hesitate to share or leave a comment. And if you would like to learn more techniques for finding, verifying, and obtaining witness footage for breaking news events, please have a look at AFP's courses at digitalcourses.afp.com.